one. I don't even remember last time I did a YouTube live. Um, I actually was going to do my glasses haul for y'all because I get so many questions about it. They're piled up, but I think I'm going to wait because I want to be able to show you guys like the entirety of my collection and how I shop for glasses online to save you guys money. I know y'all haven't heard from me in a while. That's cool. That's okay. Um, we, I, here's the thing. I have so many videos filmed. I just don't have time to edit them. Um, just the things going on in life right now. So what I'm going to do is do this live. So y'all just let me know if you like this or not. Um, on the rare occasion, I actually have my eyebrows on today. Um, I'm going to show you guys what I have been picking up on Amazon lately. Just trying to bring you guys this content, showing you how to add t to your collection without breaking the bank. Okay. Um, in my free time, I do spend a lot of time looking at deals, trying to get the best deals to add into my collection. Um, I'm a tea wear aholic You guys know this by now. Um, so let me show you. I wish I am new with the live, so don't come for me. But um, my phone will record in picture in picture. <coughs> Excuse me, but um, yeah, no. I don't think it's going to do it. Okay, so I'll just hold everything up. So, the first thing I want to show you, I literally just got this in, so I'm going to open it. I had eyed this tea pet forever, forever, and I thought it was going to come in a fancy little box. <gasps> oh, it's so cute. Guys, I saw this on AliExpress forever ago. And when I saw it pop up on Amazon, it, you guys, I, um, it wasn't on prom yet. I don't like to order stuff unless it's really on prom. So when it went on, finally did go on prime, um, this past holiday weekend, the price dropped to $12.99 for a tea pet. That's very affordable. Let me show you guys what I got. Look, y'all know we are cat people. Look at this little fat cat. And he's got the tail. Now, sometimes when you get a tea pad off lawn, sometimes they don't. And again, I'm going to try to show you all the detail. Sometimes when you get one, the pictures will show a lot of detail. But what you actually get, it's smooth. It's not that detailed. Look at this guy. How awesome. Oh, my gosh. I freaking love this guy. I have another tea pet to show y'all that I got in. Oh, man. I freaking love this guy. Does he have a little... Um, so we might have to try this out because some tea pets, if your tea pet has a hole, if you soak them in cold water and then pour hot water, the water will shoot out. I don't know if y'all can see this. See that tiny hole? I don't know if that's an imperfection or if he's going to squirt water out. I swear to y'all, if if this ends up squirting water out, that's it. Like, I'm, I swear I'm going to go get a couple more. Like, I don't know. We might have to try that out. Oh, it would make sense. It's right by its mouth, right? It looks like a perfect hole, too. So, I bet that's what it is. So, if you have a teapot at home that has a hole... That's what it's for. So I picked him up. And next, you guys, I filmed this, but I don't know if I have it up or not. My mind is everywhere um, because I'm in school and doing other things right now and I'm old. So, so I don't think I've gotten a chance to show y'all. But when I originally filmed this next tea wear piece, the price was $17.99. At $17.99, this is a beautiful guy one. But what's better? Cheaper. And the price has dropped to $10.99. This is by the brand Deputo. And I will try after this is over if I'm able to. I, I don't know if it's going to let me put all the links down below for you guys. But I love this brand. You're going to see some other things in this haul from them. Their glassware is perfection. So let me break this guy one down for you. 
So here's the lid. It's nice. It's it's thick, but still delicate. I'm going to show you another Glasgow one. It's got this 3D jewel lid. So freaking pretty. Then you have the actual guy wand itself. It's got a colored base. It's kind of notched out. And then you have the saucer, but it has the hole in it. And it's got some scalloped edging. So your guy wand kind of nestles straight down in there. And so I picked another one of these up. Let me move my microphone out of the way. I picked another one of these up to have two for taste testing, but... It is, it is glorious. Just trust me, you need this. All right, so let me open up the next thing. The next thing is also by Deputo. And when I first saw their line of products on Amazon, um, their, their prices were, in my opinion, a little bit high, but, but it, they have quality product. It's not like it's, I'm not saying it's overpriced. I'm just saying high it, it's high quality stuff and the price matches that okay so i had purchased one of these because originally this set that you're about to see was 27.99 something like that and they have them marked down and as i've checked even right now it, it's still this price they have these marked down to 10.99 and as you can see, it comes very well packaged. So let me show you. Sorry, I have to unwrap it all. Here's the brand. If y'all want to, you can type this in Amazon. There's the brand, Deputo. So, sorry, I have to inspect. All right. You get a glass side handle Gong Dao Bay. And this sucker doesn't drip. Y'all know how I feel about teapots that drip. A lot of people have asked me in my side handle teapots that I do on Instagram, does the handle come off? Yes, the handle actually comes off. And what I like about this one, the blown glass is extended and they put the ring around it. So this isn't just glued on. You know what I'm saying? It's not just attached. There's actual glass there. So it's kind of actually built into it. Um, I have three of these now. I'm not going to lie. I was a little selfish. And I bought three for, to go with some guy wands you're going to see in a second for taste testing. Um, I love this. Now, this is um, just like a decal. It's not hand painted, but it's still beautiful nonetheless. But check this out. For $10.99, that's not all you get. You also get this beautiful tea filter, this glass tea filter as well. So, again... It is delicate glass, but not fragile. It's still got substance. You've got a fine mesh metal strainer. So if y'all can see that. And then it's got this beautiful blue, is this gonna focus? Little bead, there you go, you can see that. Very beautiful, I love this. So I, I got my first one, I've been using it and um, so I was like, oh, let me order a second one for when I do taste testing. And then the process was so good. I was like, let me get a third one. But you get, you could use this as a cup if you want to, but it's actually to hold it um, for drips so you don't get drips everywhere. So for $10.99, you get both of these guys. Come on now. So, you know, I'm here to share the deals with you because that's what I do. Mama's watching the price, so y'all don't have to. tea break this is some david's tea sea berry spa from like way back in the day um my boyfriend i'll have to give you guys an updated tour of the tea area he actually just redid my shelves for me i'm so thankful thank you brian if you're watching um so i'm able to actually see all my teas now all right on to the next item i love when they come in these fancy little boxes you guys ever get teaware from like amazon or aliexpress and I'm not going to lie, a lot of times I donate them to Goodwill because I just don't have space for all of them. But um, I don't know, I like this one. Let me show you what I got. Pretty excited. Brian actually got really excited when I showed him this. Um, this is by the brand, I don't know, Tesra. Again, when this live is over, I will try to put all the direct links for you if it lets me do that. So, really nice box. I'm just showing this if you're wanting to order as a gift. This is padding. 
And as you can see, we have a new tea friend. I'm a little obsessed with tea pets right now. Don't, don't judge me. Look at this guy. So I ordered this one because if y'all follow me, you know we have a couple cats, but our main cat is Loaf. And I've been trying to find, she's our big, fluffy, black and white cat. I've been trying to find a tea pet that looks like her. This cat literally has all, almost, almost exactly her markings. And I was, when I saw it on Amazon, there was only one at the time. There's more now. And you, it comes in blue or green. But when I saw this one, you just don't see tea pets a lot in color. You'll see them in the Yixing clay color a lot. Um, but, but you don't really see this. And y'all know this is my favorite color. If you follow me, I mean, look, my furniture back there is this color. This color is in my entire house. So anyway, we had to have it. And I thought, hold on. I thought it had, I got some tea pets recently. And some of them are anatomically correct. But this one's not does have the little drain hole on the bottom, but I'm just showing you. So Loaf actually has these markings on her back. This is the exact ear. Um, she has a little black ear. So I picked this guy up. These are on Amazon. These are $20.99. I feel like that's fair because I did go to AliExpress and look, it's comparable. So if I can go to AliExpress and get it um, from Amazon on Prime and not have to wait four or five months to get it, I'll go ahead and order from Amazon. So this was a really good price. And they've now listed them in a cute green color. I might get that one. Because who doesn't want a cute tea pet in color? Am I right? So let me show y'all my two kitty tea pets side by side. Look at them. Oh my gosh. This one is just, I'm living, y'all. I'm living. Look at him. I'm living for this freaking tea pet. I think um, I've seen a different, uh, um, same style but a different face and I might have to get that I might have to get that one but anyway it's my tea pets is probably happy to be out of the box now now I can donate the box or see if one of the kids want it or something like that all right next y'all I've got stuff piled everywhere hold on I, I, I decided to do this last minute I was like you know what let's just do a live and just throw it all out there so I don't have to edit for you guys okay so, so, if you don't follow me on Instagram, you need to do so because what I'm going to start, sorry, I'm chunky and uncomfortable in this seat. What I'm going to start doing is if I see a deal drop that is so good, I need, I want to share it with y'all. I'm going to start just posting that on Instagram um, and just do like a deal alert. So if you guys want to grab something, you can get it because if you're familiar, Amazon, the price will go up or down just depending. So, this particular guy won, no joke, they have them listed on Amazon right now for $19.99. Your girl, I, I ain't paying $19.99 for a glass guy won. If y'all want to, that's fine. You do you. I'm not. However, the price recently dropped down to $6.46. So, I'm not a huge, I, I haven't had a lot of luck with glass guy wands up until I got the Deputo one. So, I was like, you know what? Six bucks. Let me grab one of those. Y'all, that's cheap for a guy one. Absolutely dirt cheap. It's hard to find them on AliExpress even that low. Typically on AliExpress, you're going to get them for around seven or eight. If you're lucky, if there's sales, if there's coupons, okay? So six six forty six came in the mail. I got it so fast. And I was like, all right, let's open this up. Let's see what it's going to be like. Y'all, I love this guy one. First of all, it's thick. Like, it's, let me just show you for a comparison, okay? Hopefully y'all can see. This one is thick compared to this one. This isn't one that you have to be delicate and pinky out with. You, you, you can do whatever. She's going to be able to handle it. I'm sorry, I've got a hair itching me. All right. I think it's in my glasses. Sorry. Um, these glasses are from wearlot.com. That video is coming soon, guys. This one, I have used it. It works so good. A lot of times, glass guy wands don't want to lock down and the lid slide around. Mm -mm. She locks down. And I was so impressed with it, uh, I ordered another one. So I got the second one, and I was like, okay, this is going to be good for taste testing tea. Typically, I will use, let me show you. 
I have a set of three of these from Yunnan Sourcing, the U.S. website. Um, he Scott sells these little 50, 60 mil gawans. A lot of times I'll use these for taste testing, but I thought, you know what? These gawans are so fairly priced. Yo, I could use these for tea tasting. You don't have to fill it up all the way if you don't want to. But then if you do want full gawan tasting, maybe you have friends over, this would be great as well. You can still see the color of the liquor. It is textured on the outside. It's kind of that hammered metal look. Um, but you can you you can see the leaves some, but you can see the color of the liquor, which is nice. So I liked it so much. I have a problem. I know. I got a third one. So typically for me, y'all might be different. If I'm taste testing different teas linear in a linear fashion, like against one another, I'm typically not doing more than three because that's just a lot trying to time and pour and everything. So three I've learned is kind of my, um, is kind of my limit for steeping tea for myself. So anyway, that was just an amazing deal. And I was like, okay, let me, let me get some of these. And, um, after I had some packages come today, I was like, you know what? I, I probably should share some of these. This You're going to see this next one in an upcoming video. Again, I haven't filmed. Haven't had it edited. Um, this one popped up on Amazon. You'll see this coming soon. Y'all, this one's $12.99. When do you ever see a guy wand with horses on there? And I was actually surprised. So, no. Is this super high quality? It's not. Is it a good basic guy wand with a locking lid? Absolutely. This one's going to get the job done. So if you know someone who is into horses, it's even on the saucer. This is also a really good little guy one. And I just thought, man, that's unique. I don't have one like that in my collection. I'm going to give you guys a sneak peek of some things. Hold on. Sorry, I'm looking. Y'all know I got tea wares all around here. Oh, I know what I'll show you. Hold on. I got... You ready? Sorry. I got a little excited. Okay. I did find this one on Amazon. I forgot. This cat tea pet. This is the one that is anatomically correct. So this one has a little bell. It's on this little elastic. It doesn't have eyes, but it does have like a molded mouth and a nose. It's kind of ombre red on the top down to like a cream color in real life. It's like this grayish cream. Yo, it's anatomic. Wow. I see that a lot on stuff on AliExpress. Like I, I got my daughter some years ago, some little bookmarks that look like puppy booties sticking out, like little corgi butts. And they were anatomically correct. And I'm like, but why? I don't know. I don't understand that. But this one is super cute. And this one came in at $12.99. $12.99. Let me show you how big this tea pet is compared to the other. This is, uh, besides my big crab on a rock tea pet, this is the biggest one. So this one's fairly large compared to this one. And then let me show you compared to this one. So some people, um, maybe your aesthetic is small tea pets. Some people are larger. I, I mean, I don't know. I like the larger for me. They're super duper cute. But So, I might have went a little overboard with the cat tea pets. But we're cat people, so don't judge us. All right. What do I have for you? Uh, I do have... I do have some other things. Hold on. I'm looking around. I'm so, <laughs> I'm so overwhelmed showing you guys everything. I'm like, man, I should just do lives and show you guys... Um, I had some other things come in. You guys, I, you probably can't see. I have a stack of mail over there. It is stuff I need to review for y'all. And Brian's like, when do you just take it to storage. Just take it to storage and get it out of the house, Valerie. You're never going to review this stuff. Someday I will. I want to show you guys what Brian got me for my birthday. And I'm going to be doing a video on this. Let me see if I can show you. Are you not going to switch? Okay. This is my Joy Resolve Barissier uh, coffee alarm clock. I have been trying this out because the videos that are, um, let me move this, the videos that are online, no one really, it's, it's all like people opening them 
and not really going into great detail. And then the videos that are a little bit longer, the people just blab a lot and they don't say anything of substance. Like I had some real questions before I ordered this. Let me move this coffee too. Sorry. Everything's in the way. So we'll get deeper into this. And I had to figure a lot of things out myself. But so you put your water in here. And then you would put your, this is the coffee filter. You would put, it swings over, sorry. So you put your coffee in here. You set your alarm. And then, you know, per what you set it. It'll make coffee at a certain time. What's really cool is it has a built-in mini fridge. And there's not a lot of information on the mini fridge. But it does have a sensor. So once there's like cream or milk, it'll kick on. But I, I found this out the hard way after many mornings. You really have to put it down in there a ways for that sensor to kick on. But if you put it down too far, it gets stuck. And we've had to take off this top part to get it off. So it's like this fine line between like pushing it halfway in. I don't know why it's like that. It does have this little secret drawer. And you can put coffee or tea. You can do coffee or tea in this uh, brewer. So you could take that off. I've got some coffee. That probably needs... Oh, it smells so good. Now... To do tea, you need an additional attachment, and it looks like this, and I think this was $28 or $38, and so, let me show you, just give you a little sneak peek, oh, hold on, you gotta like, it's finicky, so this will swing front or back, but it's pretty simple, it just comes out just like that to clean, so again, that's the coffee, or this is the T1. And I've done both. I enjoy both in there actually quite a bit. Sorry, I'm over here trying to put this up. But I enjoy I enjoy them both quite a bit. It all comes apart. Um, the soonest you can set it to uh, wake up or to make it is five minutes before your set alarm. So I saw one person complaining saying, why, you know, why can't you set it like 15 or 20? But I'm like, yo, your coffee's going to get cold in this little cup. So five minutes is appropriate to me, but it's really nice, y'all. I mean, I wake up, I've had coffee. So I have been using this since uh, uh, about April 22nd. And so I feel confident in giving a review and answering a crap ton of questions about it, but it's pretty cool. I am loving it very, very much. I'll show you guys if you want here, since you're here for the live. So here is my current updated tea wares. There's a lot that y'all haven't seen that I have filmed videos for. Tea trays to the ceiling. Don't judge me. Uh, more tea stuff up there. Current... Um, You'll be seeing these teapots. Oh, I got to show you all those, actually. That's the other deal. Um, cups and things. I have stuff everywhere. Let's just be honest. But I have downsized, to be, to be fair. I have, okay, maybe not downsized. I put a lot in storage. I've done that. I'm going to figure it out when the kids eventually go off to college and we got to, like, unpack it all. Um eventually so let me show you guys these sorry i'm really close on the camera enjoy it <laughs> okay so i am not typically um mini teapot type of girl i like traditional teapots for regular tea but gong fu i am hardcore i have learned the hard way i i'm a guy one girl i just love it it pours out quickly um i love it I, as you just saw, I have one shelf of small Gong Fu style teapots. And honestly, I don't ever reach for them. I really should just sell them and move on with that because I will 99.9% .9 of the time reach for a guy one. Um, but when I saw these on Amazon, I went for them because they're like $11.99. These are so well made. Y'all, I want you to hear the sound. 
I don't remember if it was Dawn from Mayleaf or uh, Zohan from Ghost Tea House. Both of them are on YouTube. One of them talks about when you buy a really good teapot, especially like Yish and Clay, you want it to sound like almost like a sword being drawn, like metal. I don't know. Watch the video. You'll hear what I'm talking about. These teapots are beautiful. And right now, so the colors will sell out. They have red and blue on the website. They've got one blue in stock. It's sad that I know this, but they got one blue in stock and they've got red. The red are $11.99. I think the blue one's like 12 bucks. This is going to be, if you guys love small Gong Fu style teapots, first of all, this one does not drip. And what I love, it's kind of portly. It's like fat. Look at it. But not too big. Like it's still appropriate for Gong Fu. I like, it comes with that little string attached. If you want to keep that, that's fine. Those bug me. I don't like them. But what I like is the shape because I'm actually able to hold it and do this. It does have the hole in the top. So, um, you know, if you want to stop brew in between cups, if your hand's a little bit bigger, you can do it. It's kind of a stretch for me to do it. Um, and of course it has the built-in filter inside. So I got two yellow, two red, two blue. Again, just in case I'm comparing teas, I can change the color pots if I want to or keep them the same. They recently, last week, added a blue one. It's not in here right now because I washed it, but it said it was going to be a green color. So I was like, okay, cool. I'll get it. I have all the other ones. I love them. They're, they're really cute um, and they pour really well. So when I get it, it was actually mint color. It's actually almost that color. And I was so excited. I was like, this is a gift to me. This was meant to be because it, it was supposed to be like this darker green, but it actually ended up being minty blue. And I was so excited. I was like, oof. So I, I will put the listing down for these. You have to keep checking back because the seller, sometimes there's different colors and you, you got to grab them up. They just go really fast. But I can't believe they're selling these for like $11.99. That's unheard of for these little Gong Fu teapots. And it, when I tell you guys it's beautifully made, this is high quality. It's porcelain. Mm. Y'all know, I try to say this in my other videos. Sometimes when you get a quality teaware and you have it in your hands, you can't really describe that to anybody. You just know. You know it's the good, good stuff. So... Y'all need to check these out. And if you're going to search for it, like say you want to do it right now, I think you got to look up like six ounce Gong Fu teapot. So, but after we're done, I'm going to try to get you guys those links. Especially you got to snap up the deals because, you know, Amazon will change the price on you. So I think that's all my, I mean, it's not all my Amazon packages, but I just, I don't really know what else. I've gotten so much stuff, I just like kind of put it away. I'm like, oh, I'll review that later on, and I never do. So my goal is to stop procrastinating and just share with you guys if I need to get if I need to get a deal out there and show you. Make sure you follow me on Instagram, so at Val's Variety, and I will start posting the deals. Like if I'm getting something or I see a price drop on something, I'll be sharing some things this evening, I think, because there's a couple deals right now um, on uh, like complete travel, gong fu style uh, tea sets, and they're not something, I have so many, it's similar to this, let me show you, similar to something like this, you guys haven't seen this one, this is a more expensive brand on Amazon, it's by Her, H-E-R-R, -R. so you can search that, and they make beautiful teawares, um, their colors are like baby pink, and this mint green, and I like this one because it has the flowers on the side, and the little flower holder, and then, carefully, it comes with two other cups. So, and it's even got the little grooves to help filter out the tea. And this one is so cute. Um, this one also comes with a really nice, I can't grab it right now, but a really nice travel bag that's like made out of woven bamboo it was really really nice travel bag i actually think this may be the one i take to work i'm not sure yet but this one is awesome so there's a couple sets right now that are marked down to because this one was like 28 dollars 30 dollars something like that she wasn't cheap but i had to have her but there's a couple of travel sets 
that are marked down to like 12 bucks. They just been in my wish list and I went in and saw them. I'm like, dang, they marked those down. So if you guys want, I'll share that over on my Instagram. If you're kind of looking to add to your T-Wear collection, but you're not wanting to spend a lot of money, I will post happily post those for you guys because I don't know. I'm just trying to say my y'all the inflation is real. It is hurting. It's hurting everybody. So yeah, I've been trying to just not spend all my monies on the T Wear. Which if Brian's watching this, he's probably just cursing me up one side and down the other, like you don't need nothing else. You know, but it's kind of like trying to tell, well, our argument is always, because he's a gamer, it's always like, but my stuff's digital. I can have infinite amount, and it doesn't take up physical space. And I'm like, yeah, well, it is what it is at this point. So anyway, I wanted to share that with y'all. Make sure that you're following me over there. I will do my best to just, hey, like post out deals if you guys want to get them. Grab them up. Tell me if you liked it. And remember like and subscribe. I will see you guys really soon. I'm going to be uploading all these videos that I have needing to be edited for you guys. And then if you're interested in how to do um, cheap prescription eyewear, I have that video coming up. And also, I got a crap ton of y'all following me through my faux memo videos. So if you do like the scrapbooking or journaling or you're making labels or whatever, uh, faux memo sent me their brand new model. I just have to hopefully this weekend get time to open it. I haven't even opened the machine. And if you're wondering what I'm talking about, let me show you. So I literally, some of the, my videos have like 20, 20 plus thousand views for these little like label makers. I've got, <laughs> I think I have all their models now. Um, but they're like custom stickers. You can make custom stickers. You can journal. You can, like, if you make your own beauty products, you can make your own labels and it prints out. This is a small one. I have bigger ones. Anyway, Fomemo released a new one, y'all. And they sent it to me a hot minute ago. But I have been doing school and some other things um, going on in life. And so I haven't had time to film that. But I'm hoping this weekend I can get that up for you because... I get so many questions about these little machines and it's it's honestly because these are made overseas and there's just not a lot of good English support on them. So I'm really happy that they reach out and they're like, hey, can we send this to you and you explain like how these work? Um, so typically what I do is I will kind of start playing around with it and I start writing down questions that I have. And then as I'm talking you guys through these videos, I'm just hoping I'm answering questions that I had, you know, um, or if I'm looking at it, I like to look at the listing on Amazon as well, um, and see what information is there. And then I will write down questions like, oh, well, you know, it, it doesn't tell me about the DPI. It doesn't tell me about how wide, you know, so if you guys have any questions on any amount of faux memo, be sure to comment. I do try to get back to everyone, but dang, there was an influx of y'all I, I think one day I had like hundreds of comments like and I just I couldn't keep up. I was like, y'all, I'm going to have to do a FAQ video to help you all out because I'm just one. Uh, I'm just one little Valerie trying to keep up. That's what Brian says about our cat. She's just one little loaf trying to keep up. But yeah, the struggle is real. So yes, FOMO has sent over that with all new papers. I think it was a big package. So hopefully we'll get into that and you guys will see that. But if there's anything else that you want to see, let me know. Um, I had some requests as well. Could I show um, nail videos? Now, I will do my best. Um, we actually just got all my nail stuff out of storage. Um, all my stamping stuff. Um, I still get questions on that. Because um, I'm still licensed nail tech here in Arkansas. Even though I'm not actively practicing, I'm still licensed. So, I still get a lot of questions like, hey, how can I do my own nails? And I feel like right now with inflation and everyone trying to cut back and, and things are tight, I feel like people are going to be really looking to save money any way they can and still, you know, still do things for yourself. So, if that is a video that you guys are going to want, let me know um, and I'll be happy. Sorry, hold on. I'll be happy to do that as well. 
um, just show you guys like maybe, hey, how to start out doing your nails um, on a basic level, nothing too fancy, and how to make them look good and then be able to save you guys some money because we were talking about this earlier at work is a lot of nail techs or good nail techs, they, they charge for their time. It's not necessarily the products that are expensive. Um, typically for nail stuff, once you buy it, it goes a long way. I say typically, I don't mean all product, but typically. So when you go and you're getting nails done and, and you're actually getting a good quality set of nails with nail art and everything, you're typically paying for the time. And that's what a lot of people don't understand is, you know, why are you charging X amount of dollars? Well, because uh, it's taking me, you know, an hour and a half, two hours to do nail art and do all these things because you want to look cute on Instagram. That's kind of the truth behind that. So you have to pay for their time on that. Um, but the actual products and actually applying and doing nails can be very affordable. So if you guys want to see that, let me know and I will show you my product recommendation. If you like doing dip nails, I have some friends who've learned how to dip their own nails. Um, mine right now are just acrylic from Young Nails. I love Young Nails. You still um, have to have a license to buy for them. And if I'm not mistaken, I don't think you have to anymore, but I I could be wrong, y'all. Uh, I could be wrong. I love Young Nail products, but I do know also that I have seen their products on Amazon before. So if you shop through Amazon, you don't have to have a cosmetology license. You can just buy it. But Young Nail has a lot of great starter kits, and their products are high quality. Um, them are jellish. I love both of them. But anyway, we digress. I'm sure you came for the tea wares. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, when I close this up, I will go and I will look for the links for everything for you. And I'll see you guys over on Instagram. Bye.